This block needs some help. This is the street the city forgot. Trash, trash everywhere, and no one to lead the cleanup. He was waiting for someone else to do it and never get done. But who is really responsible for cleaning all this up? Pretty sure, I mean, pay all these taxes, they should, you know, at least take care of the neighborhoods when they're getting run down. The familiar neighbors get them together and bang it out in like a, you know, a couple of days. It don't, it's not, don't take rocket scientists to clean up a block. The city of Philadelphia agrees with him. According to the Philadelphia Streets and Sanitation website, cleaning of alleys and driveways is the sole responsibility of the property owner. I clean up after I come out of my house almost every day picking up stuff. And I watch people they just don't care. They begin to care. The website goes on to say that the city only holds itself responsible for cleaning public areas. Hey, the city can only do but so much. But trash scattered throughout the neighborhood can cause other problems. The Pennsylvania SPCA sent an email to Mural stating that trash brings stray cats. They can be a danger to you or your pets, and they can also use your property as a litter box or even a place to nest. I like cats, so they're all over the place around here. Like, it's crazy. It's like one of a whole little jungle to something. Like little lions and tigers running around having babies and stuff. The debris didn't get here unless we purchase the stuff and put it on the ground. The trash and the strays have not gone unnoticed by the city. The largest cleanup in Philadelphia history is scheduled for this Saturday, April 5th, in order to help neighborhoods like Heart Ramp to clean up their acts. To get involved, visit phillycleanup.com. From Mural, I'm Amanda Reyes.